Imagine a future where humanoid robots imbued with artificial intelligence coexist with humans. This is not a science fiction scenario but a reality that China is striving to make possible. China is setting the stage for a technological revolution, laying out ambitious plans to mass-produce humanoid robots by 2025. The Ministry of Industry and Information Technology, or MIIT, is taking the helm of this groundbreaking initiative. They see humanoid robots, the perfect synthesis of artificial intelligence, high-end manufacturing, and innovative materials, as the next big disruptor in the technology realm. This isn't just about creating robots, but about establishing a reliable supply chain by 2027, a testament to China's commitment to making this future a reality. It's a vision of a world where these advanced machines are not just a novelty, but a common sight, an integral part of our everyday lives. But what does it take to create a humanoid robot? Let's delve into the components that make up these futuristic machines. At the heart of these robots lies a powerful brain, fueled by large AI models. This isn't your average computer chip, not by a long shot. It's a sophisticated piece of technology designed to mimic the very essence of human perception, control, and interaction. Imagine a machine that can perceive the world around it just like you or me. It sees the nuances in color, detects minute changes in temperature, and hears the subtlest of sounds. It's not just about raw data, but about making sense of that data, interpreting it in a way that allows the robot to understand and engage with its environment. This is where artificial intelligence comes into play. AI, in this context, is more than just lines of code. It's the robot's intuition, their gut feeling, their sixth sense if you will. It enables them to make sense of the world, to learn from it, and to adapt to it. But building a brain like this is no easy feat. It requires a deep understanding of both robotics and human cognition, and the ability to blend the two seamlessly. But the challenges don't end there. These AI models need to be robust, capable of handling a wide range of scenarios without faltering. They need to be efficient, able to process vast amounts of data in the blink of an eye. And most importantly, they need to be reliable, ensuring the safety and well-being of those interacting with the robot. Yet, despite these challenges, the progress being made is nothing short of remarkable. The brains of these robots are becoming more advanced, more intelligent, and more perceptive with each passing day. It's a testament to the ingenuity and determination of those at the forefront of this field, but a brain alone is not enough. There is another crucial element that enables the robot to move. Just as our cerebellum controls our movements, the robotic cerebellum is responsible for controlling robotic movements. Now let's dive into the depths of this fascinating control center of the humanoid robot. The cerebellum of these robots, much like ours, is the epicenter of coordinated movement. But how does it manage such a complex task? The answer lies in the intricate interplay of algorithms and network control systems. These systems are the puppeteers behind the scenes, pulling the strings of these humanoid robots, enabling them to move with precision and purpose. Imagine a symphony orchestra. Each musician plays a unique role, but they all need to work in harmony to create a beautiful piece of music. Similarly, algorithms and network control systems work in tandem, each playing a crucial role. But together they create the symphony of movement that we see in these humanoid robots. The algorithms, the maestros of this orchestra, are meticulously designed to process vast amounts of data quickly and accurately. They are the brains behind the movements, deciding when, where, and how each part of the robot should move. They dictate the pace, the rhythm, and the sequence of every action. On the other hand, the network control systems act as the musicians, executing the instructions given by the algorithms. They ensure that each part of the robot is in the right place at the right time and they do this with an impressive level of precision. A slight error could lead to a misstep or a wrong movement, and in the world of humanoid robots, precision is everything. The complexity of these systems is astounding. They need to be able to handle a multitude of tasks simultaneously from managing the robot's balance to coordinating its movements. And they do this while constantly adapting to new information and changing conditions much like a live orchestra adjusting to the conductor's tempo. With a brain to think and a cerebellum to move, what is left? The limbs that carry out the actions. In the next scene we'll explore the remarkable technology behind these limbs and how they're bringing us one step closer to the future of humanoid robots.
The limbs of these robots are designed using classic robotics technology, including dexterous hands and lightweight materials. Now let's delve into the world of classic robotics technology. It's in the limbs of these humanoid robots where the past meets the future. The limbs, much like our own, are integral in enabling the robot to interact with its environment. But creating robotic limbs that mimic the dexterity and precision of human hands is no small feat. It's a challenge that has puzzled and inspired robotics engineers for decades. Imagine the complexity of the human hand, its ability to gently hold an egg without cracking it, or to firmly grip a hammer and drive a nail. Replicating this delicate balance of strength and finesse in a robotic hand is a monumental task. But, with the integration of classic robotics technology and innovative design, the impossible is becoming possible. Key to this evolution are new materials that are not only lightweight but also durable. The use of such materials allows for the creation of limbs that are agile yet robust, capable of performing intricate tasks without compromising on their strength. These materials are designed to withstand the wear and tear of everyday use, ensuring the longevity of the robots. But the technology doesn't stop there. The limbs are fitted with advanced sensors that provide feedback, allowing the robot to adjust its grip or change its movement based on the task at hand. This adaptability is crucial in enabling the robot to perform a wide range of tasks, from the mundane to the complex. So we have the brain, the cerebellum, and the limbs. But there are still other areas of research that China is focusing on. Creating a humanoid robot is not just about replicating human features, it's about pushing the boundaries of what is possible. This is precisely the approach China is taking in its quest to pioneer the next generation of humanoid robots. As we delve deeper into the unknown, we uncover the areas of research that China is emphasizing. The focus is not limited to perfecting the brain, the cerebellum and the limbs of these robots, it extends beyond the basics, pushing the envelope of what these humanoid machines can do. One major area of research is enabling these robots to operate effectively in harsh environments. Picture a robot that can withstand extreme temperatures, navigate rough terrains, or even work underwater. The potential applications are staggering. They could be used in rescue missions in disaster-stricken areas, conduct space explorations or even deep-sea research tasks that are dangerous or impossible for humans. But it doesn't stop there. China is also developing sensors for smell detection. Imagine a robot that can sniff out dangerous gases in a mine or detect explosives at an airport. The implications for safety and security are immense. These advanced capabilities will not only make the robots more versatile, but also more closely mimic human abilities. They hold the potential to revolutionize industries, from healthcare to manufacturing, and even our daily lives. But as with any revolutionary technology, the journey is not without challenges. The development of these advanced features requires significant research, testing, and refinement. Moreover, there's the question of ethical considerations. How do we ensure these robots are used responsibly? How do we prevent misuse? These are questions that must be addressed as we move forward on this exciting journey. China's journey to create humanoid robots is full of challenges, but the potential rewards are immense. The race is on to create the next disruptive technology, and the finish line is a world where humanoid robots are an integral part of our lives. China's ambitious plan to create humanoid robots is not just a dream, but a reality that is unfolding before our eyes. A future where the lines between humans and machines blur, where robots don't just work in factories, but interact with us, assist us, and become an integral part of our everyday life. The demand for these humanoid robots is increasing, driven by a shortage of skilled workers and the desire for efficiency. But it's not just about filling a gap in the workforce, it's about taking the next giant leap in technology and society. At present, most robots we see are designed for industrial use, performing repetitive tasks in controlled environments. But the ambition for humanoid robots is far more expansive, they are expected to be versatile, capable of operating in diverse conditions, and interacting with humans in a meaningful way. This isn't a far-fetched scenario from a science fiction movie, it's the reality we are stepping into. The technology is still in its early stages and requires refinement, but the progress is indisputable. The potential for growth is immense, and the impact on society will be profound. The future of humanoid robots is exciting and full of possibilities. To stay updated on this revolutionary journey, subscribe to our channel. Don't miss out on the future, it's happening now.